Hey guys, Matt here with Crypto Blick on a beautiful Tuesday morning. I am just getting my coffee, so bear with me as my voice is a little bit lower this morning. But uh, I wanted to do a quick video here to let you know that your ledger uh, for an X and an S just came out with a new software update. So make sure to update your ledgers today. Um, make sure um, you're safe with your crypto. Make sure everything's updated properly. Wanted to get this out right away. So I'm going to show you how to do that. Right now I have my Ledger S plugged in. So let's jump in and let's uh, deal with this right now. All right, so you're going to see in my account that you know I've got some basic uh, Ethereum BAT tokens in there. This is what I use just for educational purposes for my Ledger S. Let's go to Manager here. All right, and then once you're in there, it's going to say Update Available, and you're going to see that for the Bitcoin. Let's do Update All. So fantastic. So there, I got my uh, Bitcoin app updated on my S. And then we also want to make sure that the actual firmware on the S is updated. Right now, as you can see, I have 1.6.0. Um, that needs to be updated. Obviously, they roll these updates out um, in phases, so that's why you're not seeing it right now on mine. But be looking on your Ledger Live to see if you can update yours. Um, and then also I'm going to hop on over to the Ledger Nano X here in just a second and show you um, how that can be updated as well. All right, so firmware version 1.2.4-4 is available. And then also make sure that uh, there might be some apps like the Bitcoin app here that needs to be updated. Let's do the app first. All right, so now that's updated and let's jump over to the update the firmware. I have my recovery phrase, yes. Here we go. All right, then you wanna make sure the code is correct and then put in your pin. There we go, firmware up to date, reinstall the apps. All right, so it looks like I gotta put in my pin once again. All right, then it instantly is starting to re-download your apps within your ledger. Right now, I just use the Bitcoin and the Ethereum apps. All right, so there you go, guys. So I just updated the firmware on my Ledger Nano S, or actually I just updated the BTC app on the S, but I did update the firmware and the apps on my X. So make sure to hop on over. I'll put the links in the description here of this video, but make sure to update your Nano S if you can and update your Nano X um, if you can as well. Make sure that those uh, your ledgers are updated, your hardware wallets are protected. Uh, security wise so that you know that you are safe uh, with your crypto um, the reason they came out with uh, for the X for the dash 4 instead of the dash 2 they had to update again because there was uh, you can look in the article but they said there was about a 1% of people um, who were seeing issues with their nano X's updating so that's why they released a new update um, so make sure everything's updated guys just want to do a quick video here to show you uh, and remind you to keep everything up to date. If there's any questions you have, let me know in the comments below. Like, subscribe, it helps the algorithm when it comes to getting my videos out there to you guys and the public. More videos coming soon. I've got some in the queue coming out, more exciting things coming down the pipeline, guys, and just have a great day, and like I need more coffee, get some coffee as well, and uh, talk to you soon.